Muhammad, he was standing in front of a group of people. The word taqum al-sa'a, every Muslim knows what taqum al-sa'a. Taqum al-sa'a means this judgment day will come, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. This is Muhammad. They ask him about the day of judgment. Remember, Muhammad should not say when the day of judgment will be because he is just a prophet and only Allah knows, right? Yeah. And Muhammad do not believe in the father and the son to claim, okay, only my father know he is just a prophet. But he now, he did not say, I do not know. Look what he said. Yeah, I see it. The Muslim translation in front of you, it says, a young boy of al Maghira bin Shaba happened to pass by the Holy Prophet and he was of my age. Thereupon Allah Apostle said, if he lo live long, he would not grow very old till the last hour come. Oh, I see. I see. The Muslim, they add things is not in the hadith to fix it. They say the, to, uh, to the old people of generation, what the heck does that mean? It says, as -sa In Arabic, -sa everybody knows this is about the day of judgment. Yeah, yeah. The same hadith appear in many places, and the Muslim trying to fix to fix it. If this young boy live, he might not grow very old till you till he would see the last hour coming to you. Yeah, I never saw this uh, hadith. Oh, yeah. I mean, my friend, we have tons. This guy is a fraud. Everything. I, that's why I'm saying to you, give me something strong. Like to be, let us say, hard to uh, to defeat. Otherwise, right. I can I can keep showing you stuff, you know, endless. Yeah, one of the things um, I have to say it correctly, but it was about the way that uh, in English iron was from the from, was from space, and I believe the English one? that. I believe it was the material iron that was from space and in that particular surah yeah it describes something about space and then the surah name was iron i believe it was something like that which was kind well, of first of all muhammad yeah. never named any surah this is after the muslim they decide they, they they choose a word to be unique and to put it however i will go with you mm. so the iron is coming from the space correct I, I heard at least. Yeah. That's that's not what the verse is saying. The same verse. I just I want to show you how Muslims they uh, they lie, and you know it's obviously uh, it's in the front of your eyes. I don't know why people don't see it. Here it says, "Indeed, we send our messengers with the clear signs, and we send down with them the book." and the balance so that man might should and, and hold justice and we send down iron wherein is a great might okay so did Allah send Muhammad down uh, um, no I see what you mean okay um, did uh, Allah is Allah he said saying he sent down books yeah is that literally is that is that is that literally or metaphorically yeah, metaphorically. Okay, but the only thing and then we I send down know. iron. Let's, let's continue, hold on. And then we send down iron. Is yeah. Now now you are saying that this is literally, correct? I, I've heard, yeah, yeah. Okay, but let yeah. us see Let us see how stupid this verse. The same verse will make Muhammad look stupid because if the iron was sent to the man, that means the one man was exist before the iron. Mm. No, it doesn't. It doesn't, right? Like it, it could have been like the iron would have been sent down to earth prior to the no. existence of man. Okay, secondly, this is absolutely false because no scientists say that the iron we have is sent down from the space. They say some of the iron in the crust is from the space because we have the magma and the magma is full of iron. Okay, okay. But so, still, then there so is if, some that is from So space. if some doesn't matter, so but what Allah is saying that everything you have, we send you down. Okay. The Quran says, Allah, he sent down clothes for you. Libas and warish. Clothes, 
and feather. Did Allah send us any clothing and any feather to cover ourselves? Not, not in that way, no. no oh, there is other way. How come we take the iron literally, but we don't take the feather and clothing literally? Is the same word for sending down used in those? Same exact three? word. Anzalna. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Chapter 7 to 6. Children, Seven, two, six. Okay. children of Adam, and this is the word in Arabic. Ya bani Adam, qad anzalna alaykum libasan yuri sawatukum. Anzalna, you see the word anzalna? Anzalna. Yeah. Okay, this is sent down. Hmm. Yeah. We have sent down on you garment to cover your shameful part. But did Allah really send any garment? As I know, all of them they are made in China. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Did he cover us by feather? Look, do you see the word feather? I just see the Arabic part that you marked. All right, you will see the English one. And feathers. When since when human being they are covered by feathers? Why are we chicken? <laughs> no. Okay, so what he is talking about? What feather? Maybe you know? the feathers within certain um, uh, what's it called? Like very primitive clothes. I don't know something. No. Like that. No, the, the, Muhammad is a mentally ill person. He think that, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, most likely he's talking about chicken. So Allah, he clothed the chicken with the clothing. But this is very silly and stupid to say to name it the clothing. This is part of them. Cloth is something you add in the top of it, in the top of you. Something you wear, not something is you are born with it. It's part of you. Otherwise, it's not the clothing. So here is sent down, there is sent down, Allah sent down the Quran, Allah sent down the messengers, Allah sent down rain, Allah sent down everything. So suddenly the, the, the hadith, which is the iron, only is the whole miracle, how Allah knew, same, this is false, because the blood of the man have iron. Is that true? Uh, yeah, but okay. it's still, it's a different... Okay, but, but isn't it Allah? No, hold on, I will go with you. In hmm. the Quran, isn't it Allah? The last thing he created... It was the man? Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah. Okay. So that's mean the earth is completed and nothing is missing. Correct? Sorry, can you repeat it? That means everything in the earth is sent down already and completed. Uh, ah, I see point. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. if Adam was the last thing, the did, we, iron, did we receive yeah. the iron after Adam? Yeah. I see it, yeah. Because Adam, a human being, if we don't have iron in our blood, we die. Iron deficiency causes death. Yeah. Okay. So, if we don't have iron in our blood, we will die. Iron is exist even in our water, in the magma, everywhere. So, if the scientists, they say some, not all, some of the iron came from the space, this is, have nothing, because, look, I will go with you, just to take one side. Yeah. If the iron came down from the space, that means all the iron which is not from the space is not from Allah. That will destroy Islam. No, that, but, yeah, but that's um, th that implication you can't just use. Like, I no, I can. No, say. I can because the iron from the space is little compared to the iron was exists in the earth from the beginning. So, uh, but the iron from the space in this ayat was actually meant as a application, like an outside, like outside of the body, like you can use that material. My friend, all I... the iron is outside of body because simply, like when you eat uh, uh, a tomato, there's iron. When you eat meat, there's iron. Uh, vegetables, there's iron. What are you talking about? No, I mean with the material part, like to no, use see, in order to build. Something. My friend, I mean, either you take it literally or you don't. Listen, because here it says. To have a benefit for mankind, and even he mentioned what is to kill with it a mighty war. Uh, where does it say mighty war? وَأَنزَلْنَا الْحَدِيدُ وَفِيهِ بَأْسٌ شَدِيدٌ وَمَنَافِعٌ لِلنَّاسِ بَأْسٌ شَدِيدٌ. What بَأْسٌ شَدِيدٌ? بَأْسٌ شَدِيدٌ is a word you use for mighty of war, mighty of a strength, sword. So Allah okay. claimed that He sent the iron. So people, they will use it for war. I see, yeah. So is the iron sent or we have the iron before? Same time, I want to go with you, you know, mm -hmm. 
was the Aaron created? Was the earth created by Allah? Or a fit in the earth? Or Allah he sent from the space other stuff? He sent from the space other stuff? Um, I thought them both, right? No. But... No, like let me show you. Created. No, what yeah. what the word Anzalna means simply, Allah is saying, supposedly, Muhammad, Aka Muhammad, not everything you have is from me. You know, uh, Muhammad, he did not receive a, writ a like a written book in his hand. He received verses, supposedly, from the angel, correct? Mm -hmm. yeah. But yet he used the word Anzalna. So he used it for anything you have, you know, uh, dignity, ethic, etc. You know, everything is from Allah. Now, if we go... Uh, Muhammad, he explained, the, the, the nice thing about Muhammad, that he don't shut up. He's like the kind who, who keeps uh, shouting free Palestine, but he doesn't know what he's talking about. This is Muhammad explaining to us how Allah created the earth and the heaven and everything. Read with me carefully. The messenger of Allah took hold of my hand and said, The exalted, the glorious, created the earth on Saturday, the mountains on Sunday, the trees on Monday, the things entire in labor on Tuesday, the light in Wednesday, he spread the animals of all kind in Tuesday, and Thursday, sorry, and he created Adam Friday afternoon. Right. Okay. How we will work with the scientific miracle in the Quran, according to Muslims, where it says that those came through billions of years, when Muhammad talking about Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and the whole creation is done. And now we have Adam. I see, but yeah, but then according oh, to Oh no, them, we are not uh, done, we are not done. Mm. Do you remember the video of the dad making fun of the Bible saying how the sun is created on Wednesday? I haven't heard, but... You yeah. can search for it. Here yeah. we go, this is Muhammad copying from the Old Testament when God created the sun. But in the Old Testament, you will find something different that God, he said, let be light before the sun is created. So we have sun before the light. And uh, did that he was yeah. saying how 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 the whole earth will have no light? <laughs> he was laughing because he's an idiot. He did not know what his prophet said. So look what happened now. When they asked Zakir Naik about six days in the Quran, what Zakir Naik said? But the fifth the Quran did thick date. But in the meaning, it didn't mean thick date. It means sixth period, and eighth period is a billion of years. So when the Quran said that did, he's talking about period. It's true. So now suddenly, the sixth day, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, become six period, and each one of them is a couple of billions of years. This is how hypocrite they are. It says suddenly, and not only that, Muhammad, he said, Friday afternoon, don't love at your prophet. <laughs> Friday <laughs> afternoon, Allah created Adam. Afternoon. I see. Okay. okay. Now hold on, we are not done. <laughs> but, <laughs> the second I can press was great. <laughs> So Allah created Adam on Friday afternoon. The Quran mentioned, isn't it the Quran says if Allah want to do something, he make it, he say B is going to happen? Yeah, was it for one particular thing, right? Or just in general? I thought it was Anything. for a specific thing that he said. This. Well, hold on. So are you saying to me, Allah was so slow in one thing and was so fast in one thing? No, ah, but I thought like if he wants to do it in that way, if he just He's wants talking to about creation, it. talking about creation. If he wants something to happen, he said, B, look what happened. If we go in the Quran, it says, وَكَانَ الْإِنسَانُ عَجُولَ Okay, human being is ever hasty. What does that mean? You go to Ibn Kathir and read. Uh, 